Hi guys, this is the Kime Tubes leave-in conditioner recipe that I actually use. So stay tuned. Okay, the box that I'll be using is the Kinky Curly Not Today, one of my faves. I am using um, the Lily of the Desert Aloe Vera Juice. Um, you keep this in the refrigerator, the refrigerator at all times. I am using castor oil. I actually got this here in LA at this whole store, whole something kind of store. And I also have um, a backup. Sorry, sorry, my camera's not focusing, but I also have a backup one just in case. I will be using the jojoba oil. This is from Trader Joe's. And you'll need a funnel, um, one with a wider opening. And of course, your measuring utensils. You'll need the teaspoon and the tablespoon. Tablespoon. <laughs> focus. Okay, there it is. It's focused. So you'll need the tablespoon, one in the teaspoon that I did not show, but I'll show it later. And of course, you'll need a bottle. I prefer it for one with some top of some type of top so I can shake it up and use it well. What you're going to do now is just place your funnel inside the bottle and the first thing I use is the not today you will be using the tablespoon and you will be adding two tablespoons of uh, the not today the leave-in conditioner now you can use any leave-in conditioner I just chose to go with the one that she used um, and not to mention this one smells amazing very light and it works really good in my hair little adjustment of the camera so you can see what's going on I don't think you want to watch my hand the whole time <laughs> just kind of bang that in there and then of course the second one clearly I'm running out I usually get mine from Target. Um, I believe it's nine ninety nine and twelve ninety nine at Target. Next, we'll be using the olive oil juice. It will be um, two tablespoons as well. Sorry for the background noise. Oh, by the way, this mixture has to be refrigerated. Now, if yours is like this, I just simply take the uh, funnel and kind of tap it a little bit so everything falls in there. Um, I usually do this in between. Um, I usually do it now or before I put the olive oil juice in, just before I put the oils in because it just seems um, harder to try to get the oils in there. Next, we're going to be putting in the jojoba oil, and you will be actually using the teaspoon and there's the teaspoon so you'll be using um, that and what you'll be doing you'll be using two teaspoons of uh, the jojoba oil number two <laughs> and last but not least the castor oil I actually love the castor. I love how thick it is, but you got to use that in moderation. So you'll also be using two teaspoons of that. Uh, my apologies for not having the teaspoon in the uh, camera. Alrighty, now I try to get all of it in there but whatever is left over I do not believe in wasting supplies <laughs> so I usually just take my finger once that's done dripping and I swoop my nice finger in there and I put that much usually just in my hair wherever because now my hair is wet and ready to use this mixture so that's it now 
once this mix is done and you've mixed everything I give it a little bang one more time to make sure everything's in there put my lovely top on I love using the bottle because this makes it so much easier than using a bowl mix that up really well make sure all the product is mixed together I love banging it on my hand no idea why but it just works but yeah you mix that really well and voila you have your Kimmy tubes leave-in conditioner enjoy <music>